Hello, my name is Cornelius Kölbel, and I like to show you how you can use privacy idea to add a second factor to a next cloud installation and use privacy idea to manage this second factor centrally for many applications. Okay, I have a next cloud application here, a uh, next cloud installation here, uh, next cloud. I have a bunch of users, and here's my privacy idea installation. I will log in to privacy idea. I have some tokens imported. The cool thing about privacy idea is that it supports a lot of different token types, a classical key fob token in uh, time-based mode, uh, YubiKey, U2F devices, smartphone apps, and today I will use this smart displayer OTP card here. This is an event-based one-time password token. It's re really cool, uh, very thin, and the thickest part are the magnets I sticked on the back. Okay. Now, <clears throat> Privacy Idea manages tokens by attaching tokens to users. And in a perfect world, a user will have only one token and authenticate with this single device to all his applications. Users. Privacy Idea has to know users and because of this, Privacy Idea can define connections to existing user pools or user stores. Here I have a user store definition which connects to the next cloud installation. I can add these user store definitions to realms. So I create a new realm and call it also next cloud. I set it the default realm. Okay, and now I'm able to see the users from the next cloud database. And as soon as the next cloud administrator would add another user here, I will see the new user in privacy idea and I can assign tokens to this new user. But first I will only assign a token to this administrator and this token has a serial number on the back. I can search for the serial number, here it is, and assign the token. Now the administrator has this single token and I can verify if everything is fine. Three, four, four, one, seven, six. And the administrator can successfully authenticate with this token. So the only thing we need to do now is connect Nextcloud to Privacy Idea. To do so, there is a Privacy Idea app. This Privacy Idea app is down here. Privacy Idea to factor authentication. And of course, this app can be configured. I already prepared this. You can configure the URL of the Privacy Idea server. This is the IP address and the path of the authentication REST API. And you can, or you should in a productive environment, have uh, working SSL certificates. This is only a demo environment. I have only self-signed certificates. Okay, now we are all set. And now each user who has a token assigned in privacy idea would be able to authenticate in Nextcloud. So let's log out and see what happens. The administrator gets his normal login screen and he has to provide his Nextcloud password. He enters his Nextcloud password and what happens? Nextcloud is thinking, 
and um, complaining about the weak hardware. No, um, joking. Nextcloud tells me, here, you are doing two-step verification. We need a second factor. The administrator can choose which second factor provider he wants to use, privacy idea. And now the administrator has to provide the second factor, 917541. This will be sent by the privacy idea app to the privacy idea server and get verified there. And this is done and the administrator is logged in. And on the privacy idea side, you can see in the audit log, this entry, this is the um, REST API request of Nextcloud to authenticate the user admin. And you can see, you also see the IP address of the machine that issued the request, which means if you have more and more application like your firewall, your VPN or SSH servers, you can um, manage the authentication centrally with privacy idea and um, monitor the authentication requests. So thank you for watching and subscribe to this channel and have fun using privacy idea.